Rod Mbai ameachiliwa kwa dhamana huko akitarajiwa kufikisha mahakamani Jumanne ijayo fote kisa ambapo alinakiliwa kimzaba Kofi afisa wa kampuni ya umeme ya Kenya Power. Haya najiri huko kampuni hiyo ya Kenya Power kikashifu tukio hilo la Jumatatu. Baadhi ya wafanyikazi wa kampuni hiyo pia wameandamana kulalamikia tukio hilo kama anavyotuarifu Ben Kirui. Shambulizi hili dhidi ya mwandisi wa kampuni ya Kenya Power na mbunge wa Kitui Mashariki siku ya Jumatatu ni kisa ambacho kimevunja kimya cha usimamizi wa kampuni ya kusambaza umeme siku ya Jumatano Kenya Power ilijitokeza kukashifu kisa hicho While working to with uh, the network of these illegal and dangerous connections we regrettably not an emerging trend of violent attacks against our staff shuka shuka akenani shuka somi ntolea table badala kukata kwa mita sio kisa hicho tu tishio hili la shambulizi kwa mfanyikazi wa Kenya Power akitekeleza majukumu yake katika eneo la Utange kaunti ya Mombasa pia lilitajwa kama moja wapo ya hatari ambayo maafisa wa umeme wamekuwa wakikabiliana nayo wanapokuwa wakikata umeme ulioungwanishwa kinyume na sheria We have had, in the recent past we have had a number of cases there was one in Utange where one wielded a panga against a staff who was on top undertaking his duties there was also a case in Nyandarwa where a member of staff and the CBM were assaulted while undertaking their duties of disconnection due to the fact that the payments had not been undertaken. Kampuni ya Kenya Power inasema haitasitisha operesheni za kukata umeme usiopaswa kuwepo bila sheria. Hii e, kulingana na Kenya Power imepelekea kampuni kupoteza mamilioni ya pesa. Stealing power from Kenya Power is not hurting Kenya Power, it's hurting all of us. So it's in the interest of all Kenyans for us to work together to regularize and because the president has extended this offer of saying look let us try and make things right rather than trying to disconnect everybody you also find a better landing now that you can regularize what has been illegal rather than carrying on Hayo yakijiri muungano wa wafanyikazi wa Kenya Power ulifanya maandamano kitengela kutaka kuchukuliwa hatua dhidi ya mbunge wa Kitui East Nimrod Mbai Atutakubaliana na serikali kama hii na viongozi kama mbaye ilikuwa ni aibu kubwa sana kuona mkubwa wetu isa niji ni by profession sio mtu akubahatisha akipigwa kama kama mnyama na na kama burukenge na napigwa na, na mheshimiwa mkubwa mbunge huyo alikamatwa jioni ya Jumanne na kuachiliwa Jumatano kwa dhamana ya shilingi 1050 Anatarajiwa kufikishwa mahakamani tarehe moja mwezi huu kusomewa mashtaka ya kushambulia wizi na kuunganisha umeme kinyume cha sheria. Kampuni ya kusambaza umeme nchini Kenya Power inasema kwamba itaendelea kukaza kamba katika kukata umeme uliounganishwa kinyume na sheria huku ikitaka umma kukoma kushambulia maafisa wake. Ben Kirui Runinga ya Citizen Nairobi.